today's short film is called A Creature From The Lake. It's a creepy, weird, hugely hilarious comedy from the Isar Digital Film Animation School. If you haven't already, head on over to their YouTube channel and subscribe. This is a hugely funny animation and I will give you your money back if you don't laugh. And stick around after the movie for a quick film recap and a recommendation of other films that you will love, including Night of All Fears. <laughs> the hilariously funny slug invasion, Saga of Bjorn, Serial Taxi, The Final Straw, and finally we've got Helga. Before we get to the main event, make sure you like, click that bell and subscribe, and here is Creature from the Lake.
hashtag Thug Life. Thank you guys so much for tuning in for a quick film recap. There is clearly a story in the short film. Unfortunately, due to the character design of the female character, it sort of falls short because you're sort of looking at this as a slapstick comedy, but meanwhile, it's really an adventure. Before we do a deep dive into the film, here are a couple of suggestions of films you're definitely, definitely gonna like if you like this one. Check out the alien zombie movie by Corral Osiris called The Night of All Fears. The hilariously funny slug invasion. It's so quiet. Too quiet and I don't like it. It's as if... What the fuck, Trot, was that? Sarge, what the hell is happening? Did someone just die without my permission? Oh, ah! son of a... Soldiers, take cover! Ah! Serial Taxing by Railing College of Art and Design. The killing, the killing, the killing, the killing, the stabbing, the stabbing. Ah, I always love this song. Number one. Step, 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 and you die, 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 die. The Final Straw by Ringling. Saga of Bjorn, again by the Animation Workshop. <laughs> and finally we've got Helga, once again from Ringling. Your lips. Your... your top. Your top lip. Mm, yeah, right. It's if you just run your finger. It's right. Let me just. The synopsis of the film goes like this. In the 80s, a manly and experienced manly hunter hero of a low-budget TV show, followed by his fat, cowardly camera woman, go to a remote lake on a full moon when mysteriously disappearances tend to occur. I like the environment, I like the texture, I like the animation, I like the two characters. Very well done, very small cues in terms of how each character is performing. So we've got the male character who is an egotistical monster hunter full of himself. I really like the sunglasses sort of a bit there. I also like when he put his foot down on the monster after he was sprayed by the cologne by the girl. Just to be eaten a few seconds later. I love the sound effects and the screams throughout the short film. I know it may be difficult to take your eyes away from the busty female character, but let me know what you guys think of the plot. 
So congratulations to the Isar Digital team and everybody who worked on this production. And thank you guys for tuning in. As always, I do appreciate it. Make sure to leave your comments below so we can take them into consideration when we're interviewing the directors of the films on this channel. If you haven't already, check out the community tab. That's where we're posting the latest and the greatest and digging up films from the archive for your enjoyment. If you haven't already, make sure you like and click that bell and subscribe. That's what keeps us going. That's what keeps us growing. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.